Gates are the most basic digital device. Gate means door. Its function is to allow flow of digital information, but the output of a gate depends on function of that gate. So it's not like a door which let you pass through unchanged. Each gate has one or more input. Input or output may be analog conditions like voltage, current, even pressure, but they have two states only as it is a digital device, high state or one low state or zero. If you apply voltage as input of a gate, the lower voltage would be state zero and the higher voltage would be state one. Output of the gate would be 0 or 1, 2. This IC has 4 AND gates. Each AND gate has 2 inputs and 1 output. AND gate gives high output if all the inputs are in high state, that is 1, otherwise it gives 0. Like here, we apply 0.5 volt at pin 1 and 5 volt at pin 2. So output voltage at pin 3 would be low, that is 0 stretch. Here it was 0.6 volt. If we apply higher voltage, that is state 1, in both the inputs, the output would be high too. Like here, we applied 5 voltage in both pin 1 and pin 2. At pin 3, we got 5.16 volt as output, that is state 1. AND gate basically does the operation AND. Output Y is A and B. In binary system, result of AND operation is 1 only when all the values are 1. If one of the values is 0, the result of AND operation would be zero. We can construct a kind of table which tells us the input combination for which the circuit gives one as output. We call it the truth table. So if we make a truth table of AND gate, it would look like this. A and B both zero, so output would be zero. A zero and B one, so output would be zero. A1 and B0, so output would be 0, all inputs 1, so output would be 1. We can make truth table two ways. First, from function of the digital circuit. Here, output Y is equal to A and B. We know Y would be 1 only when all the inputs are 1. That's why we could easily construct a truth table for AND gate. We can test a circuit by applying different inputs to construct its truth table. We are given a chip. In this, pin 1 and pin 2 are inputs and pin 3 is the output. Which kind of gate does this chip have? Let's find out. We took 2 voltage from a power source, 0.5 volt which would be state 0 and 5 volt which would be state 1. 0.5 volt, 0.5 volt means inputs are 0, 0. We got output 0.45 volt means 0. 0 0.5 volt and 5 volt means input combination is 0, 1. The output is 5.1 volt, that is state 1. 5 volt and 0.5 volt means Input combination is 1 0. We get output 4.89 volt that is state 1. 5 volt and 5 volt that is input combination 1 1. All the inputs are high. The output is 5.33 that is state 1. So we get 1 if one of the inputs is 1. This is an OR gate. In binary system, or operation is represented by plus sign. Result is 1 if one of the values is 1. So output is equal to A or B. Output is 1 when any of the values is 1. One more basic get is NOT. 
it just inverts the input it has single input if you give 0 as input you will get 1 as output if you give 1 as input you will get 0 as output that's why it is also called inverter now get some most basic digital device we can build complex digital circuit using multiple gates of different types and or not are called basic gates as each of them implements a basic binary logic there are other gates too like NAND, NOR, exclusive OR, NZOR when we draw a digital circuit we use a symbol for each gate just like we use symbols for battery, bulbs, switch, etc. These are the symbols for all fundamental gates. Each gate works in a different way. Just a small introduction, we'll study them in details later. NAND NAND gives 0 as output if all the inputs are 1. So basically, it is opposite of AND. Hence, we call it NAND. NOR is opposite of OR. It gives 0 as output if any input is 1. It is a buffer gate. It let the digital signal pass unchanged, means output is same as the input. NOT is the opposite of buffer. Buffer is mainly used to create a delay. These gates are the main units of digital system. People creatively use these gates to make very complex digital device like register, memory modules, microprocessor, etc. We will learn that too, but let's go slow and steady. That's all for today.